Oslo Riverhawks against the Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets. Looking for their first win over a Power 5 opponent since 2015. 10 seconds. Coleman doesn't have space. It's down to five. Sturman going up and smothered and blocked. And UMass Lowell takes down Georgia Tech. For a midweek matchup, the Binghamton Bearcats are in town. Mincy for three. Oh, yeah. That'll do it. Riverhawks come away with a hard-fought win here tonight. Very good win against a very competitive team. On senior night and taking on a very good Bryant team. On a leap day, the Riverhawks take a leap forward towards potentially two home games in the America East Tournament. It's the Jersey Mike's America East playoffs for a matchup between the number seven seed, the Retrievers of UMBC, and the second seeded UMass Lowell Riverhawks. It's March, it's the playoffs. These teams typically play each other tight. Covington is stopped, gets it up, off the window for two. Yuri, pirouette. The Riverhawks are going to survive and advance. It's cliche, but it's true. It's the name of the game in March. to the semifinals. And it'll set up a rematch with a Bryant team that you gotta think has got revenge on its mind. But now they'll have a chance to come in here and potentially end the Riverhawks season. Max Brooks takes it away with some help from Covington. Brooks elevates, lays it in. How about the athleticism? Hakeem for three! Big time players make big time shots. Covington races into the front court. The Riverhawks race on to the conference title game. It's coach, look at all this. Take this all in. How satisfying is it to pull away with a victory, pick up two wins at home, and then back to the American East Tournament title game? Yeah, I mean, it's a lot of fun. This time of year is great. Um, our guys have earned home court advantage, and you can see just how impactful it can be. Um, proud of my guys and uh, are grateful for our 